I really don't remember meeting you before. Are you okay with that? It's okay, because I remember. And you're brave, so I feel like I can count on you. You think I'm brave? I'm nothing like that. No, you really are. You already saved me several times since we met again. And you wouldn't have done that if you didn't have courage. Of course, I don't mind being more than friends. Courage is the magic that turns dreams into reality. It's just like he said. What? Oh, it's nothing. Why don't we get going? Right. Okay, let's go. This is some wind. Come on, take it like a man! That's easy to say. It may be difficult to believe, but Lady Marta is depending on you. So please, try to act like a man in front of her. I'm not sure if I can. What's keeping you two? Come Wherever Lloyd is, that's where the Centurion's cores are. So let's find the mayor and ask if Lloyd's come by, okay? Right. Wow, this wind is really something. Right now, all sorts of strange weather patterns are happening around the world. It's all because of the joining of the worlds two years ago. But everything will work out if the Centurion's cores are hatched, right? That should be true in theory. Wait, what do you mean, theory? Things are not always as simple as they appear.
This town seems kind of desolate. This is weird. The last time I came here with Daddy, it wasn't like this at all. Your dad? Now that you mention it, where's your family? M well... Watch out! Uh, sorry. It's fine. Uh, are you...? It's all right. You have an interesting creature with you. Emil, what are you doing? We're terribly sorry. Are you all right? Marta, this man, he... This town's changed, too. Huh? Excuse me, are you originally from here? A long time ago. Back then, this city wasn't even called Asgard. Sorry, this is my hometown. It brings back memories of my friends from back then. It seems they got the better of me. Forgive me. That guy, he noticed Tenebrae. Are you sure? I've never seen anyone who could do that. I wonder who he is. guy was. He said some strange things. What a weirdo. I mean, it's been a long time since this town changed its name to Asgard. Right. No human alive today could have been around then. Could he be an elf? Maybe that's how he noticed Tenebrae. Yeah, but even elves and half-elves only live about a thousand years tops. He must have been teasing us. Jerk. He may actually be older than his youthful appearance would indicate. Oh, you mean like you, Tenebrae? Yeah, maybe that's it. We Centurions are ageless. I will not be treated like a doddering old man. What do you mean? The wind isn't strong enough. There's no way a wind this weak could damage buildings like this. Hmm. Well, maybe some days the wind is stronger. Sorry. We'd better go find some shelter somewhere. There's a cave-like area not far from here known as the Mural Cavern. If I may suggest, perhaps we should head there to avoid the wind. Sounds good. Let's go. It's 
closer if we hold hands. Think so? Ah, uh, two young hearts all aflutter. How sweet. A flutter? Who says stuff like that anymore? I do. You got a problem with that? <laughs> You're funny, Tenebrae. Way to kill the moment, you two. be safe in here. Yeah. What's the matter? Your face is beet red. Your hand. Oh, do I have to let it go? I, uh... <laughs> Just kidding. Um... I wonder why the wind got so strong all of a sudden. I believe it's linked to Lord Ratatosk's sleep. Yeah, I know that's the root of the problem. I meant, why did the wind get so strong just now? Perhaps it changes in a manner similar to you. I know. I'm just a weak nobody without the help of Nida Ratatosk. That's not true. You're strong, kind, and cool. Really? Really? You're my prince, Emil. I wonder if she really believes all that. I hate to interrupt this fascinating discussion, but the wind seems to have died down a bit. It did? Yes, but now I hear voices. There seems to be some sort of commotion. Let's go and have a look. It'll also give us a chance to ask about Lloyd. Right.
Who? A top officer in the vanguard. We'd better hide. Just be a little more patient. <laughs> I just said that I'm tired. Now, now, you should know better than to... Top back to me! No wonder you let Mart Mart slip through our fingers and failed so spectacularly in Lewin. Must I do everything myself? Are you listening to me? I... I apologize. Hurry and find that pesky Coletti. I'll be at the mayor's house. Ta-ta! I'll search the city's perimeter. Will you do a thorough sweep of the city? The chosen of regeneration is a woman with blonde hair. Bring in anyone that fits that description. And do it quickly, or Lady Alice will have all of our heads. Now go! For, For the, the liberation of Silverunt! So, that girl is a member of the Vanguard? That's Alice, the captain of the Vanguard's combat unit. She's a complete sadist. Be careful around her. Be careful? But why? What's that supposed to mean? Be careful. Well, we won't be able to go to the mayor's house now. All right. Then let's go look for the Chosen, Colette. Oh, yeah. The Chosen and Lloyd traveled together, right? Mm-hmm. If we can't find Lloyd, we might be able to ask about him. And maybe... Maybe what? Mm. Well, let's just look for the Chosen. They said that the Chosen is a woman with blonde hair. Let's search the city for her. However, please remember to keep your distance from the Vanguard and stay out of their sight at all times. Right. I agree. There's no point in getting caught up with them. Looks like a harmless girl, but she makes a powerful impression. Maybe scary is a better word. Watch yourself around her. She's a sadist. Actually, a super sadist. What's a sadist? The term sadist is related to the concept of sadism. It is the deriving of pleasure by causing pain in others, physically or mentally. Okay. How exactly am I supposed to be careful around her? Don't go near her. Don't speak to her. Don't respond if she speaks to you and swear to love only me. Then you'll be fine. What? What are you talking about? Lady Marta's search for love is among the saddest I've seen. Huh? It's the saddest versus the sadist. Ouch. Why does Alice call Hawk hockey? It's like she was making fun of him or something. Actually, Alice only comes up with those little nicknames for people she likes. So the fact that Alice calls you Mart Mart must mean she likes you a lot. No, it's the opposite for girls. That nickname means I'm on her bad list. This is confusing. I hate to change the subject, but do I really come across like an old man? Huh? Wow, you've been worrying about that this whole time? Chosen is a woman with blonde hair. Where can she be? She may be the Chosen, but she is still only human. Since I have not met her, sensing her will prove difficult. I wonder what kind of person she is. Have you met her before? I've never met the Chosen of Regeneration. And to tell you the truth, I really don't want to meet her now. Oh, sorry I asked. Why are you apologizing? Um, because Marta's scaring me.
Lloyd hasn't stopped by here either. I'm sorry that I couldn't be of more help, Chosen One. Oh no, it's quite all right. Thank you. You're the Chosen of Regeneration? Chosen of Regeneration! I have something to ask you. Y yes Two years ago, the world regeneration caused the separated worlds of Silverant and Tethaala to become one. And during that process, a giant, fearsome tree appeared in Palma Costa and destroyed the city. I was told... It happened because you tried to run away from your task of world regeneration. Is that true? Yes. My mother was in Palma Costa when that giant tree attacked! You call yourself the Chosen? You're nothing more than a coward! How dare you! If you hadn't run away, my mother would still be alive today! I'm so sorry.